Hi guys, welcome to another video. As you can see in the title, it is another Neo Kyo haul. Um, I've had this package for a couple of days. It's been a little busy, but I'm finally gonna open it. As you can see, it is opened. I did pull my names off of the uh, items already. If you've seen some Neo Kyo videos, you probably know that they usually put little name tags on all of your items with most of your name. <laughs> Basically, my full name is on there, so I just went ahead and pulled it off. Um, but, uh, this is going to be a good mix of things, um, that are for me and actually for a friend. So I will show you the stuff that she got as well. Um, but I'm not going to like open all the plastics and stuff, but I will show you what they are. Um, but yeah, so let's go ahead and look at the item. Most of the stuff on top is mine, except I don't know what's in this one. Um, but this is really cute. Um, has English on it too. So it says, I hope that something wonderful will come to you. That's really, really cute. Um, Let's just see what's in this one. So that's the card. Cute. Uh, let's see. Well, the little sticker says thank you. See the card there? Can't really tell what it is. Okay, it is. Sorry. <laughs> I was right. So this is for me. This is Jay from In Hyphen. This is his uh, Weaver's pre-order benefit card. Um, I <laughs> struggled a little bit trying to get it. Two of the orders I tried to put in for this card kept getting canceled and then I finally was able to grab this one. So that's good. <laughs> um, where's that card? Connie. So there's gonna be a lot of Connie in this um, package. There's no BTS. I'm not wanting to get right now in this at all. There's not one BTS item here. Um, Honestly, right now, my collection for BTS is really just focused on older things. I have a lot, most of the new stuff that I want. So, it's things that are pricey, and I just don't have the money for pricey things right now. So, um, that's that. So, here is Connie. This is from the first album, I believe. It's called, is it Light Us? If I'm correct with that one. This is such a cute card. I still need the other one, but this one's adorable. Let me just take it out of here. So I'm gonna kind of want to see it a little bit better. Um, I didn't pay that much for this card. I think it was like three dollars. Um, but I'm gonna have to look a little bit more, uh, just because the back is kind of throwing me off. Because that's super off center. Do you see that? So, I mean, the quality is really nice. It doesn't look like really. It doesn't look like bad quality. I don't know if you can tell really. Anyways, here we go. This is something from my friend. She's collecting 17. This is, I believe, Boo, as she calls him. Sorry, I don't really know that much about 17. <laughs> She's probably gonna laugh if she watches this video, but yes, this is uh, for my friend. Okay, there, this is also for her. There's uh, quite a few cards in here. It's not protected at all. I mean, it's in like a sleeve. Um, it's fine with my stuff because Nyakyo like wraps it in bubble wrap and stuff. So it was completely fine in my stuff, but. Yeah, there's quite a few cards in here, so I really don't know what this is from or what it is, but there you go. Okay, and here's mine. This is Connie. This is, I think it's a pre-order benefit from Kissin, I believe. Um, I think you guys saw when I got one, when I bought his full set, so there was one in there too. This is the other one. Connie again. This one. I think this one is their, no, no, no. I think it might be on a pre-order benefit. It's either a pre-order benefit or, I wanna say first anniversary card, but I think that one's a different card. Yeah, this one I think is another pre-order benefit. I think it's an MMT. Cause I think Make Star will say Make Star on the back. So, whoa, this one might be MMT, whoa, okay. I ordered a lot. A lot of cards, so coming. Ah. Yeah, this one's Big Star. Mm 
more things for my friend. There's quite a chunk of cards in here too. Not sure if she meant to buy all of these, but I didn't see her pay, pay a lot for them. So whatever they are, she got a good deal on that. This is, honey, I think this is a fan sign card. And I saw quite a few listings for this and it was kind of expensive, like over 20, but then it popped up at like 17. So I went ahead and bought it. This is a fan sign card, I believe. Fan meet, fan sign, one of those uh, cards. So, this one, this one is their first anniversary card, I believe. I'll admit, I paid a little bit too much for this card. Not that much, over maybe a few dollars more than I should have, because I've seen it a little bit cheaper than what I paid, but it's okay. It's really cute. This is my Jake and my hyphen uh, Weaver pre order. Yeah, I had to buy all of these off of Japan Mercari. So much cheaper. I think I paid like $6 for this. Maybe even less. This one might have been $3 actually. I think I paid like 6 for J's and this one was like 3 I have to find uh, someone now, so <laughs> I've decided to collect them as well. So it's gonna be it's gonna be fun. So we'll find out if this is for me or my friend. Yeah. Wait, this is really cute. Oh, this is really cute. This set is really nice. Oh, it's adorable. These are really cute cards. Um. So yeah, that's for my friend. <laughs> I didn't know it was in this there. for me, Connie. This is supposed to be the, I think it's Twilight. Is it Twilight equal set? I believe. Uh, this was a pack of like six cards. These ones I was also confused about and not sure about because I placed the order. I use regular tape. Placed the order and as I'm waiting for it to go through, whatever is gonna happen, I go ahead and spy on it on Japan Ricari and I see that someone on Bai is actually trying to buy it as well. So that was interesting. And then I'm looking at the notes and I'm seeing the seller tell, you know, the Nyokyo buyer, um, you know, the person who's buying it for me from Nyokyo that they'll make them another set to buy. And I'm just thinking like, sorry, what? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> you have multiple cards? Like that's, what? It's a little weird, but I mean, the quality doesn't look bad either. So it's kind of confusing. Um, it's like zooming in and out because of the back. Um, I mean, the quality of the of the picture doesn't look bad at all. Usually when they're fake, the quality of the picture is really bad or the coloring is really, really horrible. And I don't see that on here. Um, the only thing that's throwing me off is the, the lack of little tabs here. So I actually have this card. I pulled it in my album. I'm just, I'm super thrown off by they're just being like, well, this one kind of has it too. I feel something here. This one. I needed this one. So I do have, like I said, this one, but I needed this one to finish this. I just set. thought it was kind of weird for the seller to respond like, okay, I can make you another set to buy. <laughs> I mean, have another set listed a little bit weird but anyways um this is obviously mine connie's this is um japan um pop-up store i want to say i bought the full set not 100 percent. think there are six cards in this that i bought i'm not sure if there are more um than six but i bought six Oh no, sorry, four. Oh, I only bought four. Okay, maybe I'm missing two then. Because I think there are six. Oops, okay. Well, I got a lot of them. <laughs> I think I paid really cheap for them too. So. They're adorable. He's so cute. And he has blonde hair again, which makes me excited. So yeah. These are these. Oh my goodness. 
These are also from my friend. She bought a bunch of slogans. I'm not gonna open them like I said. I'll just kind of show you. Kind of see what's inside. There's this one. Uh, this one with a note. <laughs> This one, <laughs> it's in this <laughs> Disney World Tokyo bag, which is kind of cute. Um, but I can see a fan in there. I think it's a slogan. Um, <laughs> and then there is this. It's just a slogan. There's no like freebies in it. So. Yeah. <laughs> there was one more card for me in there. Okay, it went to the side. This is another make star pre-order benefit. I'm so excited for one of us to come back. I don't know if this, the album is called Devil or the new song is called Devil. If you guys saw on their Twitter, they tweeted it out. It's gonna come out sometime in January. I'm so excited. I think it's January 19th if I'm remembering. This was a kind of a big haul. There's more stuff here, but half of it is not mine. <laughs> Um, half of it's my friends. That is this Niyokyo haul. There's going to be a second, uh, second, whoa, a third one because I've already made a couple purchases on <laughs> uh, Niyokyo. So there's going to be another one. I'm trying to see what else I can get from there. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I am going to go ahead and film um, one more video right now because I have some things to, to, get, to get through right here. A couple of boxes. So... <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next Ni Yogyo haul. Okay, bye. Did not buy since March, since pandemic. <laughs> um, and it was pricey as heck to send to myself because it's so big. I didn't even order anything that massive, so I'm so confused as to why it's so big. Like, I don't get it. It was very expensive to ship this to myself. Why is there another box inside of here? Oh, you know why? I remember why. Okay. I guess technically this was supposed to be the only thing I was shipping, but I added something on at the last second and they just doubled the box instead of just opening this one and putting it in. Okay. Well, the shipping price didn't change, but still, which is fine. But like, why double the size of the box? I didn't think they were going to do that. I honestly thought they were just going to open this and then put it in. If I would have known that, I would have just not done that. <laughs> well, now I know. <laughs> why it was so big this, this box size makes more sense but it was still $50 to send this out just disclaimer because I had been checking the price for shipping for this package for forever and it was still $50 so it didn't really matter the size of the box um, but anyways I don't remember what I bought honestly not gonna lie I think I know what this is I don't remember what's in this one I just ripped it Oh my goodness. This is gonna turn me on a loop because this is probably the other way around. Okay, never mind. Okay, <laughs> I thought this was in here. Okay, I don't know what's in the other one then. Okay, so this is uh, one of Jin's um, Japan fan club registration cards. Um, I got it for really, real, really, really cheap because it's like damaged. You can kind of see right there. I got it for like $17. I've been seeing this one sold for like 40 usually, so I got it for such a good price because of the damage. And it's not even bad, you can barely see it. And I love blonde gin, like this This is like my epitome of gin right here, so. I had to when have I saw it. it, I had to have it, so I did. <laughs> I just bought it, it was pretty cheap. Um, I, I don't know what's in it. I, I honestly thought that was in here. Oh, I still have this box here, I moved over. That might be a little bit better. I can't remember the last two things that I had waiting to like ship. I started buying more stuff from there because I wanted to have more stuff to ship so the shipping was better, but I just decided to put them together, whatever. I'm, I don't know, I'm not gonna use Bayou for the time being because it's too expensive. Nyokyo is fine for me, I've actually ordered more stuff on there. I really, I like Nyokyo. It's not expensive at all, so. I'm so messy with opening stuff. Oh, okay, this is what this is. The I thought this was in the first batch. It's not, okay. 
this is a lot smaller than I thought it was going to be, even though I have the other postcard, but for some reason, my mind thought it was bigger. Okay, so this, it's not even in a top loader, it's just in this bubble wrap and a cardboard. That's unfortunate, I stopped to put it in my own top loader for a little bit. So this is a uh, Jin's Japan, sorry, oh, yeah, well, let me start over. This is Jin's Storm Package 2015 Japan Edition postcard. Um, look at, oh my god, this is like one of my favorite looks on him ever, honestly. <laughs> the Jorts, yes, okay. So yeah, this I found pretty cheap too. I mean, it's Jin, so he's not really on the cheaper side, but these are kind of hard to get, so they are usually a little bit more expensive, no matter the member, but I actually found it for a pretty good price, so. I went ahead and got it. Of course, I've been looking for, you know, Tay and JK, but they're way expensive as usual. So I don't know if I'll ever get it. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> so now I just have like galore boxes. Okay. <laughs> okay, that's great. I... There's some one S in here. Like I said, I purchased this so long ago. I think when I bought this, this one S album was new. <laughs> but now they have a whole new album and like a, no a new single came out in December. So that's exciting. <sighs> oh my god. <laughs> I'm just not having it right now. And I'm hungry, a little bit hungry. So that might be it too. I just had one of those days, you know? <laughs> Alright. Oh, okay, cool. Okay. Let's just do this first. So, this is, maybe you know, if you've seen some of my collection vids, you might know what this is. Okay. This is the... Soul, okay, it was open there. <laughs> oh my god, okay. This is the Soul poster, it's Tay. So I have Jin and JK already. Um, I got it for cheap, because uh, cheap. it was like 20 bucks. I think because it's kind of damaged, if you can kind of see right there. I don't know, there's some like markings on it on the back, like, on the matte side, so. It's not bad, so. Okay, these are the smart BTS. Uh, I don't know what version this is. School version? I don't know. <laughs> I do have some of the other versions, if you guys probably saw. So I bought these because there were some group photos. This one's like fake signed. And then it had my bias line along with it. So I said, screw it, why not? It wasn't that expensive. So it was like $10. I saw pe see people sell these for kind of more than that. <laughs> So to have like my literal bias line along with two group photos, I thought was like probably like one of the best things I could ever find, honestly. Oh, I'm so happy actually. Oh, they're adorable. I love like the school concept. I don't know why, I, I just like really like it. Here is the One Us's album and it's time. I don't, uh, I'll just open it here, right? Obviously not sealed. really nice packaging actually this is really nice but compared to their other albums this one's so massive like the other albums are so small and then there's this one it's like huge oh it's like a letter oh, okay gotcha 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 so ah, i bought it can i get everything out i think i did <laughs> I bought it with all of, yes, <laughs> this is so cool, with all of Honey's cards. So it's the full set. This is the MMT pre-order benefit card, I believe, this one. And then these are the ones from the album. Again, really cheap. Like, I think I spent like, this one's kind of dented. That's unfortunate. Oh, well, they all are. Huh, interesting. Um, it's okay. Um, I don't know. I 
paid very cheap for this. This is even his like hand postcard, I believe. Too. So these are really cute though. These little stickers of them. <laughs> so adorable. I like when BTS do them too. I like the chore. It's cute. Oh, I ruined the packaging. Of course I did. Um, 